Hi, today we are making some alu parathas and here I've got all the ingredients for the fill, uh, filling. So this is boiled potatoes. We've got some finely chopped onions and these are the green chilies. Don't chop them too fine because in case someone finds it too spicy then it's easy to spot these green chilies and remove it from the paratha. This is salt and this is chopped coriander. And uh, my cousin Deepti has kneaded this dough. <laughs> I'm finding it funny because it's the first time she did this and I should say that she did a pretty good job. So next time I'm going to show you how to do this also. It's really simple. Okay. So you mash the potatoes. Don't forget to wash your hands before doing this. Okay. Mash it nicely. I'm going to mash all the four potatoes. It's a lot of fun. Alright, last one. It's a bit tough. Okay, there we go. Alright, I'm going to add some onions. I'm not going to add all of it because there should be more potatoes than onions. It's alu parathas. Okay. I'm just making sure there are no lumps. So you just, yeah, that's my nephew, Bigu. He's just three years old. He's quite amused with what's going on. We decided to keep him here. Okay, I'm going to put all the green chilies. We like it spicy. And some coriander. This coriander, uh, my cousin, she grows it in her garden. So, very soon I'm going to post a pic of that too. This fresh coriander from her garden. Okay. Smelling really nice. Okay, now you add salt to it according to your taste. I love salt, but I hope there won't be too much. I think that should be fine. So I add a little bit salt to the dough also when we need it. Very just a tad bit. So basically the salt you're adding in the alu should be enough for the alu only. Okay, that's ready. Thanks.